OBS Studio Screen Capture. How do you do it? I'm gonna show you exactly how to do that in this video. Stay tuned. What's going on, Rockstar? Thanks for being here. My name is Jory, and if this is the first time you've been here, why not consider subscribing so you won't miss any of the video goodness that I make just for you. So how exactly do you use the OBS Studio Screen Capture? Well, in order to show you, we're gonna to have to hop on over to my PC. So let's go do that right now. So once again, here we are back inside of OBS Studio, and let's say I wanna actually use the screen capture feature. How do you do it? I'm gonna show you how I do it. What I would do is on my scene, I would add a new source. So you would do that by clicking this plus sign right down here, and I'm going to choose display capture and I already have an existing but if you didn't you would add it new and just name it whatever you want but I'm going to use my existing display capture this one right here so I'm going to say add existing click OK and what you see is the whole inception thing going on on the left hand side but let's say I just wanted to capture out of this entire screen capture let's say i just wanted to capture these buttons right here how do you crop this window down just to do that it's pretty simple all you need to do is you see these handles the little circles in all the four corners even on the edges what you do is you hover over it and then you mouse click and you at the same time hold down the alt key on your computer now I'm using a PC so this is how you do it on the PC and then you can crop down exactly what you want so let's crop that down and I'm now gonna crop it right up and then I'm gonna crop it on over to the side over here and crop the other side and there you go and then when I transition now now you see here is the screen capture that I have right there and I can move it anywhere I want. All I need to do is just now grab this and move it and place it anywhere I want. So that is as easy as it gets to use the OBS Studio screen capture. So there you go, OBS Studio screen capture. Wasn't that hard, right? Easily done. I hope you did enjoy this. And if you want more of this kind of training, I'd like to invite you to download my free ultimate live streaming checklist, which will provide you the exact process that I go through each and every time I live stream to have a perfect live stream. I will leave a link down in the description below if you're interested. Thank you so much for being here. I do appreciate it. And I hope to see you in the next video.